Welcome back to World Drum Club, everyone. I'm Kalani, your host and teacher. And I'm gonna show you a couple ways you can play a rhythm in 6-8. 6-8 is our triple bass rhythm, also called a compound rhythm. It's felt in two sets of three, one, two, three, four, five, six, one, two, three, four, five, six, used in Afro-Cuban music or implied in lots of Afro-Cuban music and what we call world drumming all over the world in the drumming realm. So what we're gonna do is first uh, figure out how we're counting this. I've got the metronome here. Just listen to the metronome for a second. One, two, three, four, five, six, one, two, three, four, five, six. So what I've got is the main beat set up. And then I'm subdividing it in, in threes, in triplets. And on this metronome, I can turn the triplets up and down. You might want to have something like that for your own practice um, purposes. This is a Dr. Beat DB88 old school analog. Got a speaker. It's got a dial. <laughs> it works great. Um, whatever kind of metronome you use, that's, that's sort of how you want to uh, set it up. Now, what we're going to do is first I'm going to show you an easy way or the easiest way. I think you could play a tumbao or a, a you know, an accompaniment pattern and I'm using my but by the way I'm using one of my favorite drums here I'm using a Valgi original Sunset Factory Valgi Super Tumba look how big this drum is this is one of my favorite drums prized possession I, I bought this in 1982 82 83 from a guy who bought it directly from the Valgi factory and uh, never took it out of his house and I've never taken it out of mind, basically. This has never been on a gig. Anyway, that's another story for another day. Um, but it's a drum that I, I'm really uh, happy and proud to have cared for all these years. It's in pristine shape. Um, you can look it up, Valgi. All right, um, let's go to the first way I wanna show you how to play this rhythm. So what we're gonna do is just use an alternating hand pattern. Uh, you have the overhead view, and what we're just going to do is play one, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. And we're going to play one, two, three, four, five, or one, two, three, four, five, six. You can do it either way. Let's start with a really easy way. We're just going to put one open tone on beat five. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four. All right, let's hear what that sounds like. I'm at 100 BPM, 100 beats per minute. Okay, so that's alternating hands, right, left, right, left, right, left, playing in open tone on beat five. All the rest are basically you could call them muted tones, bass tones, touches, you know, it's just that. Really easy. Now let's add another bass tone on beat six. So one, two, three, four, five, six. Let's go. So what is the right hand doing <laughs> that the left hand doesn't know about? Let's isolate it. So one, two, three, one, two, three. It's just kind of that waltz thing, right? One, two, three, one, two, three. And the left hand is a copycat. It's doing what the right hand is doing right after it. Just following along. So that's why I think this rhythm would be great for beginners, um, anybody, you know, children, older adults, anybody who's a beginner and you want to either play something simple or you want to teach something very simple and have them do it. All right, let's look at now what I would consider to be the more traditional way uh, in the folkloric, you know, in the idiom um, that would be more typical for a conga player to play. 
In other words, somebody who's practiced, who has more experience, and who's somebody and somebody who is reflecting the traditions. All right. So in that style, in that way, we're going to use the hand fingers. We're going to use this technique, hand fingers, and we're going to play one and two and three and or one two three four five six one two three four five six. You can do a fingers. On beat four, one, two, three, four, or one, two, three, four. And then five, you could do one open tone there, or you could do five, six, two open tones. Uh, I'll play it slowly, then we'll play it with the metronome. So, hand, finger, slap, or a muted, a muted slap. It's not a tone that you're going to bring out. It's just more of a, like a muted tone, like an easy slap. Easy slap. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. So either way on beat four. I've showed you both ways, right? So either at fingers or the palm, just whatever you feel like. One, two, three, four, five, six. Sansa Ulio, E R Sansa Ulio, one, two, three, four, five, six. Uno, dos, tres, cuatro, cinco, seis. Uno, dos, tres, cuatro, cinco, seis. Let's go to the metronome. Mm. One, two, three, hey. fun you guys I would recommend just doing that hang out with the 6 8 uh, tumbao you can play it the easy way but I recommend quickly moving up into the uh, more traditional way which I just showed you and that way also is balanced right it's sort of a um, I don't want to call it a paradiddle it's not officially but it's it is basically a paradiddle so it's it's a um, even because it's left, left, right, left, right, right, right? Or if you're right-handed. So we're kind of uh, leading with our left. We're, we're on the pulse with our left hand. And then the right hand is playing all of the kind of uh, texture, color, interesting stuff. Uh, all right, it's, com it's playing that part. Left hand, laying it down. It's laying down the rhythm. And when I said earlier that this rhythm is two sets of three, that's why, because the left is, uh, uh, it's playing that pull. So it's not a three, four, it's not one, two, three, one, two, three, it's one, D, 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 one, two, one, two. That's why it's called a compound meter, because we're feeling the two. One, two, one, two, and it's broken into threes. Oh, one, two, three, 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 one, two, three. Hey, you guys, like and subscribe. Hit the bell. It's always fun to hit a bell, so just hit it. Maybe it'll ring. This is World Club, uh, Drum Club. I'm Kalani, and uh, thanks for dropping by. Make sure to look at the many, many other videos we have on the channel. Enjoy practicing and go out and make some great music. Make some people happy. Get them into the groove.